Alright, so we're going back into space to play some Metroid Prime. Back into space. With uh, lots of things. So what's our agenda here? Ooh, agenda is, um, you know at the beginning of the game there was like that uh, space station we were on? Yeah. And uh, it blew up and everything? Yep. Yeah, so it actually crash landed on the planet and we're going to go to it now. Oh, totally, really? Yeah, except uh, now it's underwater, which is why we went and got the gravity suit. Because uh, otherwise, this would be terrible. Terrible without the gravity suit. In fact, the game kind of wants you to go here without the gravity suit. Yeah. And then turn around and get it. <laughs> but I've played this game before, and I know I don't want to do that. Because that would be terrible. Because you, you get like halfway through it. Yeah. And then the game's just like... Yeah, you're gonna need a gravity suit for this. So, yeah, that's 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 what they did. Whoa, hey, what are those guys? Oh, yeah, space. they're just uh, flying space pirates. Okay, so you blow up the space station. You're like, I'm Samus. I'm gonna wreck stuff up. Yeah. And so these are survivors of that. Um, well, some of them like had a base down on the planet, anyways. Oh, okay. So it's probably not. They're probably not survivors. They were probably just here in the first place. Also, hidden missile just very out of the way. Well, it's not really out of the way since it only took like a second to get it, but yeah. it's very hidden, that little hidden spot. So, okay, so you're underwater. I, I don't like that they call it the gravity suit. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? I've mentioned this before. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. It should be called the aqua suit or the hydro suit or the... I feel like the gravity suit should either A, allow you to defy gravity, or B, allow you to, like, stick to walls. Like, walk on walls and ceilings as if gravity was there. Or, I don't know, somehow have gravitational... Something more gravity-related? Yeah. Yeah, let's... Yeah, let's... Uh, yeah. Be, yeah. Be able to create black holes? I don't care. That would even be better. Um... Yep. I, I guess this is more of a buoyancy suit. <laughs> what the boy okay, that's a lame name. <laughs> that's a pretty lame name. I'm not gonna lie. The buoyancy suit just doesn't sound cool. <laughs> it just something about the word buoyancy just doesn't sound hardcore. It doesn't sound Samus. Buoyance. It's like it's too cute of a word. It's got it's yeah. It, probably because it's got boy in it, so you think of adorable little kid and then it's got <laughs> And then it's got Nancy, so it sounds like the name Nancy, like a cute little girl. It's just too adorable. It's a t it's too cute of a word. Whoa, yeah. what's going on here? Everything's purple. Yeah, so this is the room we fought the uh, Parasite Queen in. Oh. Yeah. Remember this place? And and you walk around there, and then I shot a bunch of missiles, and it, it died in like three seconds. Like, what is she a parasite to? What, like, because parasites are usually smaller than the thing they well it they mutated it and everything so oh so she was originally a small thing and they made her bigger yeah why because they were running experiments <laughs> that's why okay i was thinking like maybe there's like space dragons that are really really big that we don't know about and she was a parasite for that <laughs> like like ones that make rid like ridley's actually not really big he's actually like a gecko and there's like Komodo dragons in space floating around in comparison <laughs> to size. That would be uh, crazy. And uh, the cosmic turtle. And the chosen. Uh, okay. So, anyways, what is this? Uh, it's a door. I just. Oh turned yeah. It on. Okay. So, we're, so this is the, basically the station you were on before, huh? Yeah. But it's underwater. Yep. Yeah. It, it's pretty much the same layout. I think it would be really funny if, like, you were like, you saw like a like a uh, like stuff from the Titan <laughs> Cthulhu. Yeah, Cthulhu <laughs> is really trying to wreck us. Do you meet episode. him in this game? Do you eventually meet him? Like, no. Is there because that would be really cool? Like, in, throughout this game, right? You've got these tentacle arms that are <sighs> constantly trying to grab you, and then eventually you reach a boss. And when you kill him, and you go like you you fight him, and it's like ah, you fight you know not Cthulhu, but whatever, some kind of tentacle thing, right? Big eyeball, whatever, right? And then you kill it, and then later when you backtrack through the game, the arms are gone. Like that would be neat. <laughs> like it's like oh, you took care of him. Like the whole time it was one big thing. Oh yeah, that would be really cool actually. Yeah, 
Listen to me, Nintendo. I'm great. I'm filled with great ideas. Also, bees. Just more bees in the game. So, uh, um, no. There's already so many. I love bees. Why? They're the worst thing. Bees are great. No, they're terrible. You're terrible. Um, I don't believe so. All hail the queen! <laughs> I, I, I think Trevor's been infected with, uh, space bees. Space bees? They built a hive in my heart. Uh, what? What just hit? Why are you? Oh, uh, yeah. That guy kind of... Whoop. Where's the other guy? There he is. I feel like we're, like, in an 80s, like, music video or something. Or, I mean, not music video, but, like, poster. <laughs> <laughs> we're in an 80s poster. Yeah, like, whoa. Okay. Oh, yeah. it'd be great if, when that opens, all of a sudden you get sucked out. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like it opens the door and, like, decompresses in the water. And... Watch this. Super secret. Missile. Super secret missile. Yeah. I have too much of an imagination to make the game better. <laughs> yeah, you, you might just go a little overboard if you have, like, complete control. I should, yeah, I should never be allowed to, like, have complete control over a game. Yeah. Because it would just be, it would be like, there'd be, like, rainbows, and, uh, like, but the rainbows would be trying to kill you. And you'd be like, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> it's so pretty, but so deadly. Yeah. The rainbow, the rain, and then they'd be the uh, yeah, and then there'd be like uh, oh fish. <laughs> Sorry, uh, that that's a little thing I like. There were little fish that just went by. Yeah, yeah. See stuff like that. Th that should be in games. Some like, I'm just saying like that's a nice little thing that they didn't really need to put in, but it's 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 good. Like it's like oh little fish, you know. Yeah, this game has like a ton of like polish. Yeah, polish is good. And. Um, and like, what? It, it would be nice if like there was like little butterflies in the game too. I love butterflies. I'm sure there are butterflies somewhere, and we just haven't <laughs> noticed them. Yeah. Because there's there's tons of like little things like you can find like bugs crawling around places and like like real small ones, and they're just like in a corner somewhere, and you just wouldn't notice them normally. So detailed. Butterfly. Uh, yeah, this is where we go. Okay, this is a really hard power-up to get. Mm. We have to do a double bomb jump mm -hmm. underwater. Double aqua bomb. Oh, I missed it. All right, you can do it. Yeah. Hey, only two tries. Energy tank acquired. Woohoo! Yeah, so that one's uh, it's a little tricky. Aqua bomb, it's tricky. So okay, so you're underwater. Yes, we were underwater. Not are, for are long, they, though. We're, we're about to surface. It would be great if, like, Sebastian just showed up and was like, Under the sea. <laughs> Under the, the sea. sea. <laughs> I was thinking about the song Under the Sea and how it's basically a song about Stockholm Syndrome. <laughs> like, <laughs> so, like Sebastian's just like, like, Don't leave, it's great here. Like, like, ha, like, it, like, but he doesn't actually really know what the surface is like. Like, he's <laughs> saying it's better, but he hasn't been to the surface. I mean, he eventually does later, and then they try to cook him. So well, he's he, right, but he, he doesn't might know. <laughs> he might have been to the surface before, but like he's not really been there. Like he's maybe been on the beach. <laughs> the beach is the surface. What? The beach is the surface. Yeah, but I mean, like he doesn't really like live there. Like he's like he's like down where it's wetter, down where it's better, under the sea. Like he doesn't really like. He's just <laughs> he's he's like a needy like a, like clingy girlfriend that's just like don't leave me, Ariel, stay. It's Stockholm syndrome. He's been... Uh, that's what the song is. <laughs> yes. Film theory. <laughs> hey. Oh, oh, you check out those flowers up there. T turn left for a sec. Uh, the yeah. flowers, yeah. Oh, yeah. They're flowers. Pretty... They I exist. Like hibiscus. I like hibiscus. Hibiscus. I isn't that... Isn't there, like, um... Some kind of food called hibiscus something? You, you can get, like, hibiscus and put it in, like, food and, and tea and stuff. I love hibiscus tea. Okay, that's probably what I'm thinking of is tea. Yeah, I drink that all the time. Also, we're going to go to a totally new area. It's going to be exciting. Ooh, purple stuff. What are those? Like, just, uh, okay, intense radiation detected. Yeah. Like, do you have to have a special anti-intense radiation suit? Yeah, we actually <laughs> get, um, unlike most Metroid games, which only have three suits, mm -hmm. There's a fourth suit in this game, and it makes you invincible to radiation. Oh. So, like, 
can you get okay i was about to get really dark there never mind um <laughs> okay i was gonna say cancer and then i realized that wasn't funny um so never mind <laughs> uh well you already said it so. i know but now i feel bad and i'm bummed out okay what's going on here so uh this is the space pirate base uh it's the phase on mines where they're mining phase on and doing crazy experiments and we're gonna stop them because experiments bad because experiments bad yeah so cinnamon cinnamon <laughs> he said experiments bad oh oh okay ah uh, yeah yeah <laughs> juicy fruit all right so I love how the spider ball, like, that's a completely, that spider ball, that, that, that's like, that's a spider ball section that's just completely, like, a, a, a designed gating mechanism that was just, like, kind of dumb. Like, yeah. that one right there. Anyways, it's been ten minutes, and uh, here's a save point, so. Right. Goodbye, everybody. Bye.